Baltimore County Police released the name of the man they say is a serial robber. His latest heist involved a Pikesville Wells Fargo Bank branch on Friday. That ended with an officer fatally shooting another man who was also involved. WJC's Live, George Solis has the latest on the investigation. George. Good evening, Vic. The suspect initially referred to as the aviator has been revealed as 45-year-old Michael Stratton. Now, police say he is also the suspect in several bank robberies in Baltimore this month. Hidden by large sunglasses, this FBI wanted serial bank robber nicknamed the Aviator has been unmasked. Baltimore County Police say he's 45-year-old Michael Stratton. They say they not only believe he's been involved in several bank robberies in the Baltimore area, police say he's the one who robbed this Wells Fargo in Pikesville. Police shutting down a likely escape route in the area of Old Court and Falls Road, and that's when they say things took an unexpected turn. Police say Stratton and his getaway driver identified as 33-year-old Otis Colvin tried to get around the blockade, nearly running over police. He encounters this vehicle. At some point during the encounter, he fires several shots. The shots strike one person in the vehicle. The other person was not hit. From Sky Eye Chopper 13, you can see the aftermath of the crash that followed. No others were injured. Police say Colvin died after the shooting. Witnesses describing the chaos to WJZ. I was just helping some customers, and suddenly we just heard four or five shots go off over around the corner. Police also say no gun was found in the suspect's car, but they did find some bank property and some cash. Now, we're also told that there is body camera footage, not of the shooting itself, but from an officer who responded to the scene that is yet to be released. That's the latest reporting live. George Solis, WJZ Eyewitness News. George, thank you. The officer who fired the shot is on administrative leave.